Hi everyone and welcome back and today we are looking at Monster High School Ultimate Secrets Monster Mysteries. Claudine Wolf. She was found in Southern California at Target for $29.99. Uh, check your targets. They're probably all supposed to be like getting them now. There's a new doctor channel from Manfred Law Quarters. Blah, 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 blah. Mm -hmm. The whole spiel. Five plus looks. Yes. Uh, <laughs> so like that means like, oh, I can put one leg warmer on her and not one leg warmer. It's like when this with thing tight, is. Without tight. Yeah. It's like one different shoe, one mm -hmm. different one shoe. Earring, both earrings, no earrings. There's no <laughs> earrings. <laughs> oh, Headset, no headset. Yeah. Headset with mic. Only mic. Well, yeah, <laughs> just the mic. Put it in her head. Yeah. <laughs> her head. Um, these are kind of super annoying to open. Yeah. Uh, maybe it's because we're doing it on camera, but like if we were off camera, we'd have more fun. We'd just be ripping them. Yeah, but I would just be tearing this box open. So, <laughs> um, Thankfully, there's no water play features here. You just have a key that tells you irrelevant information. Uh, here are the rest of the ghoul. I'm starting to find Cleo. So good. Give me Cleo. The most annoying part about these dolls, though, is you can see the doll. Just not enough to. But you can't, yeah, head. see the doll, which is actually pissing me the hell off. Why would they do that? It's like they heard us being like, "Put a window." They're like, "Oh, okay." Well, put a window <laughs> made out of wrought iron, so you yeah. can't see the doll. Very intricate details. Yes, and here is Claudine's barcode i tried scanning on the app uh nothing comes up but if you scan them in store it does come up which i don't understand like shouldn't that be the same system i don't know if you work at target let me know <laughs> makes no sense to me okay so here are the instructions this is so like piss color to me right now i know it's gold but like it's so She's gold. yeah I think, oh, Cleo's going to definitely have gold, too. Yeah. Or know. blue, if her thing is gold. No, nah, it's going to be gold, right? I don't know. Because Jackie Boy is pink. She doesn't have oh, you're right. Yet. You're actually correct. Did the person <laughs> do this? For every single one? That just seems crazy, no? Yeah. Like, for every single one of these dolls, one person, I mean, obviously it's not one person, but a person taped these on yeah, <laughs> like um, that's a little crazy that's crazy again i want that to be my job Yellow. it's gold i guess she should have a purple one and it's the same garbage that we've been seeing you don't even need this to see it like you can now it's gonna be too similar to cleo's no probably oh my god what's cleo's gonna be probably teal, be teal? which is teal with a blue window which is crap, because I think gold is, like, Cleo's color, and so Claudine should have been purple. Yeah. Like, there's no shame. Dracular's is pink. Like, mm -hmm. hello. So here is the beautiful box. Like, they did such a good job on this. Mm -hmm. I just really love it. And we're going to take is the key. Is there thing in the back to hang them on the walls? Oh, there is. You could technically still hang these on the wall. I know a lot of people do that with these just to save room, but I don't have the wall space. Yeah. Uh, so I'm not going to do that. I love how it looks when people do it. Like, yeah, I think it looks really cool, but no, I can't do it. I don't, I, I don't have the wall space. I, I, ideally, I would want every doll collector that I know and love to have all the space in the world. And have like huge generous mansions. Mm. So oh, so these are the instructions. And that's where it's telling you how to build this thing to turn into the lever that pushes the doll out. And then this is actually quite useful. If I mean there's no writing to tell you what to do, it's just kind of pointing and you're kinda of like what? <laughs> what? <laughs> At first you're pretty confused. Yeah. Um, but we're gonna open everything first because I actually want to use the little lever thing. Mm. So here is Claudine's bag. I want this as like a wallpaper, you know? Yeah, it's really pretty. Release a PDF for every kind of thing like this. Please. I would love it. Um not a fan of this color. Oh. Okay. I don't know. Like, what is it? Uh, it's got gold on it, but... It's like... It's like a 
like a dirty gold. You know? Yeah. Like it looks like old gold. That's I'm like tarnished. Kind of like a bronzy color, maybe. Yeah. I'm not, not that particularly cool. a fan of that. Um, here are Kaladi. Oh, she's got a skirt. That's cute. Why does Claudine get the skirt? Right, that should be Dickulars. <laughs> a bow right there. That's so not Claudine. No. I love that, though. I love, like, this sort of stuff. And she's got her leg warmers. Her second shoes are crazy. Oh, my God. got to open those. They're already sealed. Why did you tape them? <laughs> this is, like, a waste of resources. You should not have the machine and or person that's doing this do this. Because it is a waste of resources, I think. Is it a necklace? No, that's her bag thing. Oh, Imagine her neck being that skinny. I'm skinny. I want to see what Cleo's second shoes look like. I haven't really been that spoiled on these. Because, like... No, I haven't either. I've seen, like, the dolls, but I, like... I haven't seen... Know. I didn't zoom in. Yeah. I didn't look at the details. Let me get this. These are cute. These are giving very much G1. Yeah. Like, you know, like, the straps... Like, this is just, like, a row of straps right there. So good. These are amazing. These gravity yeah, heels. they're crazy. I know they're meant to be, like, more like a ballet-style shoe, but I'm going to call them gravity heels, so you can't stop me. <laughs> she also comes with her chest piece. I still think they all should have had a necklace sculpted into it just to help it stay on better and just so that the neck wasn't so bare. Yeah. And then she comes with two of these hangers. And here is her little lever piece. Oh, this way. Look at that sculpting. It's so good. Yeah, it's so cute. And then the heart goes in here. You know, if they wanted to go a little more crazy, Abby should have gotten a snow snowflake and Claudine should have gotten, like, a, a dog paw or something. Or just, like, a moon. A moon Yeah, or like, something. have this be, like, moon-shaped. That'd be so cute, actually. This is her super cute brush. Oh. <laughs> you can see that there's like a a jewel shaped wolf right there and there's spikes and this is like the, the clip that you can put into either side of these hearts and I'm going to put it right there her headphones where she's not listening to that <laughs> because to her ears are up here honey what the hell <laughs> what what Maybe it's like wolf technology where this is just for show, but all the speaker stuff comes through here. Yeah. Because like, what? <laughs> Stop giving the werewolf characters headphones. headphones. <laughs> it doesn't work. <laughs> give her iPods or give her AirPods or something. Yeah. And then here is her microphone. Whoa, like, she looks a little crazy. Little filter. Just like an outfit. She looks a little. Oh. <laughs> That is her. Um, unique. Unique? <laughs> Alien superstar. Uh, oh, here it is. Oh, hers is just completely different. It's like pink. Oh. I'm like, I want that for Dracula. What the heck? <laughs> and then there. And then you take... Uh, what a horrible combination of colors. I don't know. They're really doing my girl Claudine foul sometimes with these colors. It'll have to do... And then here, this piece goes inside so that you can assemble the hangers right there. Again, we talked about it earlier where like none of these other pieces would let themselves to be on a hanger, yeah. which is why like the Rainbow High hangers remain superior because they have like the pants one. Mm -hmm. That's, I could just put the leotard on. Oh, was that you? Yeah. Why did that sound like everywhere? Duh. Oh, so we're gonna close this. And then there is, if you can see it right there, a little nodule for this to fit in. And we're gonna open Claudine up. Oh, wait, I forgot to show her. It's not as bad if you force the top to be in off the shoulder. Oh, wait, actually, that's kind of cute. So she comes with a bag. I've heard a show. I wish that this was like moon shaped or something. I guess it is because it's like a circle. 
it says claw right there. So cute. There's so much detail in this. Because, like, we got something similar to these in Generation 1 with dance class. Mm. Um, like, they all got their own little individual uh, athletic bag. But these, these take the cake. Did I show this yet? Oh, her top is really cute. Mm. It's like a wolf with little moons. The sculpting team at Monster High, do not F with them. No. Like, no. you could never... And then here are her gloves. So cute. I prefer this. Like, who did it? Like, the, the RuPaul doll from OMG. Mm, um, Speedster? Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. Hers are amazing. Okay, so she goes up. Oh, she's like, no, I don't. No, I don't. And then you take her out of here. Oh, my favorites. God. Sorry, guys. I'm just stunned by this doll's perfection. Even though she's got Polly, this is my favorite Claudine. Just right off the jump. I'm not even going to front. Well, my favorite G3 yeah. Claudine. Uh, G1. There's a lot more competition in G1. Yeah, I was like, G1 Claudines, don't even, don't even try to no. compete with her. <laughs> she's a perfect doll. Oh, my God. Okay, I'm going to show the second outfit while Tony dresses this one. <laughs> oh, yeah. There's this weird, awkward piece, again, that you put into here. Oh, you can't do it if this is in the way. I think flawed design right there. So you put it in here, and it moves up and down so you can put the doll in there without having to worry with her falling. But I'm not going to do that. The shorts are not her skirt. Oh, she's got a squirt. Yeah. Honestly, I love a good squirt. 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 So this is a regular. This is a what? Because I think that means I have to put this underneath here. Uh, <laughs> I was like, maybe this is the video that we don't have to put a cut in. <laughs> we might have to put a cut in. We might have to. Uh, but here she is. This is her signature doll. And Tony, the beautiful genius that he is, uh, put it in off the shoulder right here and of it definitely it looks thing. more like athleisure like yeah she's like dancing like or maybe something if you want, you can do a one off the shoulder so it looks more like yeah and i think it fits like the color scheme i'm not mad at um i'm gonna definitely redo her hair i think i'm gonna give them all high ponies or something something like, something to get the hair yeah yeah so i don't know uh, but this is Polly, and this is a two-year-old doll now, um, and it feels like actual caca. Actual caca. And this is a doll that I just had because I went crazy and I bought like ten of each signature doll. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, so because I knew that you know we were gonna get second outfits and maybe we might get fashion packs, so I always wanted to have more dolls than I needed. Yeah. But I think this doesn't look bad at all. This is probably really cute. I might give her two pigtails. I don't know. Cleo. They are. Which means... Oh, Thanks, oh wait. Thankfully, the, the sparkles in hers are moons. Oh, crap. Let's look at that real quick. So they all have different sparkles. I think... Uh, Abby's was like snowflakes. Yeah. And I think Jack was just circles. Or yeah. Dots. Or like hearts or something. something. I don't know. I'm going to have to look at them later. But... Yeah. This is actually super cute. Do you guys just play the second outfit? I know that that's kind of like a privilege kind of thing to do because you have more than one of the same doll. Yeah. So, uh, I don't know. Do you guys do that? Anyways, Tony's going to dress as doll and then we'll be right back. And we're back and our resident lesbian is here. <laughs> uh, having the most incredible face. I couldn't pick a better Claudine. Yeah. I think that out of all, of all the main three... Um, Claudine is the least prone to the... The wonk. The wonk. Yeah. Just because her eyes are so big, big and open, you know? Yeah. She's so... She looks kind of mean. Mm -hmm. Not mean, but like condescending. She's kind of like... Something mm -hmm. about this line makes them look like more severe. Yeah. She looks so incredible. And her baby here... Cleo. Cleo's face up. Oh, oh my, my God. Gosh. 
I feel like Cleo also, like Claudine, has the least amount of wonk that I've seen. Yeah. At least in like our area. And the the faded eyes helps. Oh my god. Look at these beautiful baby hair. Mm -hmm. And she's got little micro braids in the front. Imagine if she was fully micro braided. That'd be crazy. Especially because they do it for fashionistas. Do it for my $30 doll, bitch. Like, what the heck? Yeah. That moon crescent shape right there in her face. Oh my god. Look, this is my favorite Claudine. Yeah. My favorite base, for sure. Oh, Which I feel, like, like, I feel like Claudine would be a good base for like a Twilight Sparkle human. Because mm. I see Twilight Sparkle as like a black girl. Twi uh, yeah, me too. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Look how pretty she is. And then here's the outfit on. We were super excited it was a score, and now we're not. It just cuts her really weird here. Because of the tights situation. Yeah. Like, like in Dracula's video, if you saw that. Yeah. It's doing the thing underneath the bodysuit because the fact that it is a squirt. Yeah. But it's got multiple layers of tulle and this super cute printed fabric. But none of it's hemmed, so I'm just kind of nervous. I mean, tulle's never hemmed, I guess. Something about this Claudine outfit is giving me spirit, uh, or, um, Halloween Town. <laughs> Oh, the do 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 Especially like the skirt. She's getting Marnie. Um, this color I wish was this color. Yeah, for sure. This is coming out of nowhere. It's nowhere else on her. Both Abby and Jack had their gloves match their headsets, so I don't know why. Yeah, and then that's really cute. I love that. Everyone's like hating on this. This like type of screen printing. They're like, it looks so bad. I'm like, I think it looks fine. There's three D printing to it, so it looks good. Yeah. And, like, these chains, these are some of the most incredible yeah. shoes ever. Oh, my God. Look at that detail on the bottom. Like, they don't have to do that, you know? Mm. It could just be solid. But look at that. Beautiful. Right. Beautiful, 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 beautiful doll. Incredible, Claudine. And now let's put her headset on. Where she's obviously not listening to music. <laughs> <laughs> Unless there's some... We, again, like, weird technology where yeah. it's, like, blasting it through there. Yeah. That it's just for aesthetics. Which, you know what? That makes sense. I would be down for that explanation. Oh, you know what? The, the headset cuts off the hair perfectly to where the ba the, the microbraid stops. So it gives the illusion that she has more in them than mm. she does, you know? Yeah. Kill yourself. <laughs> so beautiful. Okay, so what do you guys think? I Favorite Claudine base... Uh, not sure about the outfit. I really like Monster Ball Claudine's outfit. Yeah. But this, this base... This giving Y2K. She's so damn incredible. Mm -hmm. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I think I like her more than Dracula. I don't know. Baseball? Like, maybe because my Dracula is not perfect and this Claudine has a perfect face. I'm more like, wow, I love I you more. I don't think that they're fighting much in the outfit department. Uh, Dracula's outfit's better. Yeah, but... This base, base doll, doll is, is really good. this base doll is actually untouched. I'm just like to myself, I think about Cleo. I think Cleo's gonna kill them. Yeah. I think that's why the if universe was like, the, you didn't need to find her because you'll die. If all these dolls in this line had that severe face screening, Cleo's yeah. gonna eat them up. My little mean, nice girl. Mm -hmm. My little nice, mean girl. Please. Please, please, please. I love this doll. I love this line the more I look at it. Um, I've been I've been trying to be more like subjective and not objective, and be like mm, I'm not gonna love it on it so much. I'm sorry, you love what you love, and you are probably here on my channel because you love Monster High too. So let's just be honest. I love these dolls. She's a ten. She's mm -hmm. a full on ten. Uh, I do think that her. Uh, bodice piece could be way more detailed because yeah. it's the least detailed of the ones that we've seen. And um, her tights, I don't agree with the base color for the tight material. I think instead what they could have done is make the tights like a skin match to her skin shade and then making the sparkles like purple. Yeah. They the gold is very color. random to me. I know that Claudine does get gold, but it's very much more of a Cleo thing. Yeah. So it's, it's going to be two so much, gold... You know? Dolls, because I was like, Dracula often gets silver, but I don't recall her doll having silver on it, you know? Yeah. Like, I don't know. I think that these should have been purple. For sure. She's so beautiful, and I really hope you guys pick her up, because the more I look at her, I'm like, oh my god. What do you guys think? 
Let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comments, and we will see you, hopefully, in Cleo's video soon. <laughs> uh, bye! bye.